Thanks for signing me up back there, you crazy pig. Yes, Mr. Elder. Sign us up for a suicide mission, Mr. Elder. Did you forget there's like a kajillion ghouls out here who want to kill us? Nobody gets to kill you but me now. Shut the duck up and keep moving. I'm telling you, Borman. Ain't no happy ending in this story. Stalkers don't get happy endings. We get each other. So watch my back. Good news is we reached Heaven's cabin. Bad news is there's two friggin' ghouls casing the joint. We chase everything, but there are no secrets. Where are the secrets? The ones in the north will catch Hammond and squeeze the secrets from his head. Hammond will tell us what the junk is for. The junk is for us. All of it! Nighty night. Over here.
Overwatch. Zone ghouls stripped this cabin clean. Almost everything useful was gone. But it's a good thing ghouls can't read. They ignored the diary hidden inside Hammond's desk. Me and Duck aren't big readers either. But we look for answers in the diary. And all we get is more questions. Hammond writes how he found the crash machine near his cabin. He's convinced the machine was sent as a message from a mythical place beyond the zone called Eden. Where everybody's happy and safe. When Hammond sees another machine fall north of here, he takes his stalker crew up there to find it. I close the diary. Here's the problem. Eden's a fairy tale. Some bedtime story mutants believe in, so they can get to sleep at night. So either Hammond is onto something, or his brain's got the rot, and he's about to kill a bunch of good stalkers. Guess we gotta find out. Me and Ducks have to go north. Farther from home than we've ever been. It's dangerous. Ducks thinks I'm crazy to press on. I don't disagree with him. about some stupid Eden. But we need to find Hammond. And if he's going north, we're going north. If he's going north, that makes him a grade A certified loony. No one goes up there, Borman. And what's with those two stalkers he took with him? They should know better. They're following orders.